Hello YouTube and Twitch. How's everyone today? We're just gonna be making another episode of Resident Evil uh, 3. You just part of I see the yeah, I see your feet. I saw all the signs. Explore a bit. Yeah, they're all just props. I don't like that though. Here's all the bioweapon testing. Okay. Ooh, I don't. Like, I know there's gonna be a lot of people going to be just. Ooh, okay, so this is where we need to come back to make the vaccine. Just like an RE2. Powder. There it is. I'm just blind. I'll take that. Give me as much shotgun ammo as you can give me.
Uh, I signed 2020 because it's lava is a den of monsters who conduct cool and barbaric experiments. <laughs> that is very true. Y'all are a little bit of a uh, cuckoo birds. But that's okay. You don't realize it until it's too late. Alright, oh, so. Going back this way. And I can see your little tootsies. Fine for me, just to You're not dead. I know you're not dead. So you're hit. Ooh, that's awkward. If I remember correctly. Ooh, these are cool. Hard footsteps. Bug me or something? Oh, you're right there. I'll come put you in misery. I'm a pretty ruthless person. I want all my goopy goppy sounds to not be making them. Yeah, these guys.
That's so weird that they had like a whole factory that stored. Alright, I appreciate you kicking in the music. Oh, I see you. So many. So I guess I didn't need my um, Magnum. Ooh, can I get my card back, by the way? No? Okay. Oh, 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 there's... Actually, that's awkward. I don't got a save room. At least not at the moment. Really do anything with you at the moment. Give me a second. go in there just yet okay fine I yeah, can't do anything with you either So if they're not gonna attack me, I'm gonna take a second. Jesus, is this where they're made? A little bit. That's cool though. I like the design of these. Time to go up. I would like a save room though. It'd be nice. Make sure you're dead. Out of the way! 
Ooh, that's it. Give me a lot of stuff I can't work with right now, game. Yeah, a lot of stuff I can't work with. Extreme amount of stuff I can't work with. So it's called the okay. Nexus. Yes, yes, it is. Okay, I really don't want to do this. That's the only way I'm going to get past this area. An adjuvant sample. These are combined with antigens to increase immune system response. And there's going to be tons of people who come out this door. And I have the shotgun for it. They all bring. Grab my shotgun, Emma. That's not the wrong one. We come in here. Bam. Gets up. Pull this out. You're kidding me. I wasn't told we did it. Mm. I wasn't told we were going to. I wasn't told we were just supposed to. Two plus two. Oh. <laughs> That's annoying. So it's called the Nemesis. That's annoying. That's annoying. Make sure we gotta search everything. I didn't get the memo. I thought that's what the machine over there is for. Was to mix it, not my two bare hands. Let me just peel the jar open. <laughs> Take a quick sip and just go on my day. <sighs> Come on, sirs. Why do we have to do that, all that? Waste it all my time. Oh well. At least we can just move on with my day. Let's 
let's go and do my pocket real quick and go to St. Luke. Oh, I'm so mad. I you don't you don't know how mad I am. Don't you know how man it I am I am so man. I furious. I'm I'm just fear I'm furious. Like I'm actually kind of pissed about that. I thought that's what the goop thingy up here is for, not. <sighs> that frustrates me. Watch this. It's gonna be so funny. She's here. Place the materials in the chamber. Yep. And watch this. Sorry for your eyes. Hot blade is. It really likes holding a neck.
Nice. Actually, before we do that, make sure I get all I want on me. Make a quick save. Select everything in the room. Your life depends on it. It's kind of does. We better get some like shit ton of shotgun ammo. And I think we're ready to go. I wouldn't mind having the, the radar. Radar. Rah, 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 rah. But that's okay. What in God's name is this place? It's Hail on Earth. You know what? I can't. I will bring... A, whatever fire rounds you have right here. Hello, variety. I'm in this business to get paid. So let's make a deal. You go down there, battle the nemesis, and I'll record it all and sell the combat dart. Put on a good show, and maybe I don't need the vaccine. Agreed? Good. All right, sir. I can I can work with that. spot for you. Good idea. Watch 
That's not very light. That's not. Fair point. I forgot. Gets a little toast. And now... I died. Come on! Come on! Jill! 
Okay, Turkey. Breather, real quick. Can I go back real quick? I, I need my ammo. <laughs> All right. I have to get that vaccine back. Okay. And run away. Yeah. Oh. Through the door. It's done. Give me the vaccine, you greedy son of a bitch. No, 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 no. You, Prince Mom. I like her. We shall make ours an ongoing arrangement. Now drop the gun! Explode, and you can't put a price on life. <laughs> Good luck, Nikolai. Jill, go after Nikolai. He's got the vaccine. What about you? We're running out of time. I've got this. I know you do. Look, just so you know, this is the last fucking time. So that's just instant death. Okay. Gotcha. Uh, I'm just gonna be sure to keep an eye on Nemesis movements at all times. Thank you, sir. Thank you, game. I appreciate the tip. I would never thunk that one. Okay. Onward.
気がするんですけどね。Good num num on my dead body. Uh, would you like to continue in assisted mode? Aim assist enabled, health regeneration will correctly wound, enemies are slightly weaker, and assault rifle is available from the start. Gain an additional ammo when it's new. I'm fine, game. I just need to figure out how to not have him just keep flailing. Which I think is gonna be the AR. I might need to burn him. Trusty old shotgun ain't gonna do it. this bitch alive. Yeah, uh, we're good. Hold up for just a second. Okay. 
does actually care where I aim. Oh, that's not a thing. <laughs> All power sources activated. Power you think up. I don't know how to fuck you up? Riddance. And actually went through walls and everything. I go through the hole in the wall. Oh no. Oop. Never mind. There's a hole in the wall, but not that hole in the wall. This hole in the wall. Looks very familiar. <laughs> this is almost where Leon and them. Not going to stop. 
promised you this, didn't I? No! Do you have any idea what you've just done? No, no. Don't care. My client ordered me to reduce umbrella to rub. Ten minutes until missile ah. impact. The missile has launched. And that is my cue. Goodbye. Miss Valentine. Shame you didn't listen to me when you had the chance. <laughs> for everything, even letting the world burn. Who are you working for? I'll tell you, if you get me out of here, I'll pay you whatever you want. You're a fool. You're a fool! If I die, you'll never find out the truth. I don't mind a little detective work. You also kind of deserve it, sir. Jill, you all right? There he is. I just saw I mean, it then and there. The ashes of Raccoon City would be Umbrella's ashes, too. I would end them. Once and for all. Yes. Okay, well, we're gonna take the credits as a chance to talk. Um, I got I was pretty open to my clarity on how I felt about the game. Uh, overall, I enjoyed it experience. Uh, it's nowhere near the original. Especially having played it myself. Like, I watched all the YouTubers and then talk about it and be like, 
Yeah, no, it's not as good as the original. It, it's too short and stuff, which I don't think it's too short. I mean, RE2, I think I did in like nine, ten episodes. But I think I did both a half of the story in eight, eight, nine episodes. And my episodes are generally about an hour long, shaving off a couple of, or half hour or so of recording. And it's a pretty similar time. I did this in six episodes, give or take an hour or so per episode. I think I can look through my videos real quick and show you, like... Like, give me a second. Like, just going through my own videos. RE2 took me Let me find my last video. 18 episodes. It took me 18 episodes to get through Resident Evil 2. But it is including the fact that I sat down and, you know, searched each and every single corner. I mean, just record, like, I'm going to be shaving out most of this video because of the, uh, just the, all the wandering because I'm a slightly stupid. <laughs> but we're at... We're at 169 minutes, which, let me double check my math on that, is almost three hours. I'm, I'm sitting here for three hours, which is potentially, which I'm just going to edit down to my normal hour-long episodes, because a lot of it, a lot of that time is just me wandering around because we weren't that far from the end of the game because i know this game is a lot shorter than the uh other ones and i might i might edit it down so well this is in past tense obviously when you guys get to see the videos you'll see how they get made out um anyone that is here watching which i don't think there is no anyone that were be sitting here watching this is the video will be edited down between one to two episodes. Um, overall, I enjoyed the experience. Um, my, I guess my biggest gripes is just the 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 hospital scene is essentially the shortened down version of the of the the church and clock tower from RE the original RE3. And on top of the fact that they, I didn't mind it as much for RE2 with the tyrant, uh, the Mr. X, the community has dubbed him, I think, yeah, uh, I think it is community made, but anyways, like in RE2, Mr. X was annoying, but wasn't like over opposing, like you could stun him and then move on with your day. And then go back to your your daily objective with no you know no questions asked. But in RE3, and I've made this complaint already. I, I know I've already mentioned this, but they changed how our, how the nemesis works. And I'm okay with making like a progressively more mutating monster that like he does in the original, and progressively gets harder. But like, it, it's frustrating when there's points where you should be able to fight him in the in the original RE3, where it just completely ignored, and you can't fight the original the nemesis. And and that there's points where I died because of that, because I'm going off of what I know for a fact is how it's supposed to play, versus what they changed. That's really, on, honestly, my biggest gripe about it is just they they did shorten the story and got rid of some key like character developments, and a lot of the side stuff got made like they they took away the main story and then slid in the side story to make 
Which makes it a little more, like, canonically makes sense. But, you know, if you're not a huge fan of Carlos, well, that kind of sucks. You spend a little bit of the game just playing him, but it, it doesn't take as much as it would have if you could just gone around the story. I know Joe gets sick in the in the second game. You have to play as Carlos to protect her to get the vaccine. But there's other points in the game where you can just completely ignore, or it, I want to say ignore. You can, you can you can speed up the process as playing as Carlos to get back to Jill, if I remember correctly. And so it's just interesting that they're like, well, right, we're gonna make sure this guy is a little more important to the story. On top of the fact that my personal thing I didn't like about it is it didn't make it clear that the nemesis, like if you're going, if you're, if you, the very first RE game you've played is RE2 or RE7, where the the main, I guess, antagonist boss aren't killable until they get to their certain boss fights. But if you're coming from the originals, like playing them as a kid kind of originals then that's gonna and then and then you never play like especially if you never played re2 or 7 and you're coming like right into 3 like they they remade your favorite game of the series and we're gonna jump you right in then it's gonna mess with you and as a person like myself yeah it, it messed with me and it's just a little frustrating um other than that the the it looks great. It sounds great. It, it's a great game to be put into the the roster. I personally preferred the original over the the remake, but uh, which is annoying. I've only died like once or twice, and then like the end of the boss fight where I died like three or four times. But that's just my fault. <laughs> but yeah, I did it. I did it in six hours, ignoring the. Almost eight hours to actually play. <laughs> but yeah. Um, I don't think I'm going to do any of the DLCs. Like I did with RE2. Let me. Look through. Um, which I'm not done just yet. Because I'm looking. I'm going to look through the extras. And the shop hasn't been locked. You can purchase items from the shop. Which is viable. So this will be the main menu. Points used to unlock items can be earned by completing in-game challenges. View them in the record screen. Okay. So, we got a shop. So we can buy Jill. Which we already have. We already bought Jill. We already got these. I wonder if we can get, like, buy more and just <laughs> literally one-tap people with, like, the worst what Like, become a living god with, like, instant regeneration. And then, you know, just one tap anyone with, like, a knife. That'd be funny. And we don't need these anymore, because... Um... Okay. Is there... Actually... Yeah... I saved 45 times. <laughs> Inferno will not be touching. Uh, Nightmare will not be touching. Hardcore will be not touching. I just did the standard and I have not done assisted. So. See, if I click continue, I'm. Yeah, it's just gonna put me at the end of the boss fight. So. No need doing that just yet. Because there is no. New Game Plus. From Regret. So, weapon. I already have these. Samurai's Edge, the Hot Dagger. Again, I already have these. So we hit 
Hot Pockets. So a lot of these are the ones that I can purchase or complete more. And I can cl complete in-game ones to get the more of these. Okay, concept art. Miss Jill Valentine getting her RE remake redesign. With Carlos getting his redesign. Which I don't know why they make made him go from like a really nice clean looking guy to a guy who looks like he just got out of bed. But I like I like the new design. And then our team of ca uh, supporting casts. The nemesis. But you didn't get that much of a change of design. Like looking at him from like the the Funko Pump that I have sitting right beside me. Like that it changes his his Drake hack is more makes him look like he's walking around in tr trash bags rather than the coat he has from our, the original. Um, yeah. Which I don't know why they tried to sit here and redesign. Like ah, he's meant to have uh, weapons, so uh, we're gonna give him like weird cybernetic guy. Never understood. I saw these before. I, I don't know. I never understood why. See, the one on the right looks cool. Because like, he's just a super mutated, roided out dude. Yeah, don't give me like, cyborg. And I do like his upgraded designs from the other games. And then you have the Hunters. Raccoon City. Which looks dope. Be an interesting city to live in. Jill's apartment. I am not me. You're not. But yeah, just looking through all like their concepts of designing the game. It been funny if the action the guy was actually alive, but he just sat so still that none of the zombies seemed to bother him, and his astronaut suit gave him enough like containment. That they kind of smell if he was alive or not. So they're just like, ah, eh, it looks like a statue. We'll just want to touch him. And he's sitting there just. <sighs> the whole time. Construction signs, hospital, you know, underground areas. Yeah, beginning of the game. Mega Man. Okay. And then we have the models I want to look through. Okay. So last escape. The really cool thing is since they completely remodeled and obviously made him 3D. Well, I guess he was 3D either way, but um, the when they had the the Resident Evil chapter for Dead by Daylight, like they just picked like they saw this, picked him up, slapped him into uh, Dead by Daylight, and it called it a day. And I think that's really cool. Jalen Carlos. Okay there, Joe. You look a little funky.
Ah, so they do have, like, what would it look like if she became a zombie? Interesting. Good for him, too. Weird. But yeah, see how cleaned up he looks? And then... Man, I got out of bed. Nikolai. No one's like you. I might be someone that relates to this guy. I mean, like, yeah, man, he's so cool. I, I wish I could be him. Brad, no. These are cool though. It's, 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 it's always cool. Hey Sally. Hey Sally. Seeing like the, the designs behind them. Dumb little dunks. Yeah. It's Nia. Look at Nia. Darn, it looks so much like Nia. Fucking hate these things. Like, massive icky icky ugh. Little cricket shits just put on steroids. Hunters. Cool enemies. Not as cool as lickers. <laughs> yeah. And you're dumb with little fishes. Yeah, we got a licker. Oh, he's screaming. He's singing a song. These guys are okay. Mr. Nemesis. All trash bag and everything. With a flamethrower. Rocket launcher. That's what they consider a stage two. Okay. And then Charlie Dolls. Okay. So we're back from that. And there's gonna be more. So this one is just completing all the challenges. I need a hero. So, again, this would be a lot of my, on, on, a, on my own time. But, it'd be interesting. If we could, uh, it would be cool if we could get, like, a... We have all our upgraded weapons, and it just gun ho. Hello, chilling. 
Yeah, and this would just be like side quests, like going out and killing things with pistols. It's close on that one. I didn't touch anything with a grenade launcher. So this would be like going back and just going back with just, just the one gun and then getting going on with our day. The mag and yeah, the magnum. Yeah, this is just this is just replaying. This is just going back and replaying and doing achievements. Uh, knocked the hat off of 28 zombies. Cause nemesis to relinquish an item. Yeah. See, I just took my time. Oh, so I, mi I missed a weapon part. Oh, that makes me sad. I missed a couple of files? That's annoying as well. Yeah, it will just be going back on my own. Complete the game on hardcore. You think you're funny, game. <laughs> And Conquer is, I assume, the harder game modes. And then RPD material. Yeah, I'm not. The UBCS and then Stars material are uh, hardcore and a nightmare. <laughs> I think I'm the only reason I think this one is just because of me. That's fine. So for these are just. I'm surprised I didn't get that one first try. And that one is the one that like not take my time. But like. I feel like I would need, especially these, and these are probably mandatory on the harder difficulties. You just pick your one gun, take all this, don't worry about like anything, and then just gun ho. So, but I'll do that in my own time. But yeah. Finishing thoughts, overall, still love the Resident Evil games. If I had to choose, be if I had to choose between RE2 and 3 to go for like replaying, cl completing all the bonuses, RE2, they're pretty even. RE2 and RE3 has always had like a sit right dab in the middle soft spot for me on like picking in which game to play or not to play. So, it's one of those just, get there when we get there. But anyways, I think I'm going to just finish it there. Thank you for watching. I hope, I hope you all enjoyed it. And, uh, I'm still trying to find RE4. So until then... I think the next RE game I'll touch, dip my toes into, is going back to the original. With RE. So I have, I have RE0 and. Do I have the, coll the, the collection? Um, the Resident Evil or Origin collection, which gives you go both RE0 and RE1. Go back to the beginning, the story, witness the first glimpse, and the evil to come on Resident Evil Zero. Or, 
start from the very beginning, gameplay wise, with R E one. But that's gonna be for a different day. Thank you for watching. I hope you all enjoyed, and I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye.